let's fly away If you can use some exotic booze There's a bar in far Bombay Come on Oh, love it. Look at that. Starting today, you can sign up to take part uh, in early morning dawn patrol flights in Old Warbirds at Mesa Falcon Field. Yeah, isn't that cool with the American flag waving in the wind, gorgeous mountains in the background. Uh, so this is called Dawn Patrol Flights in Old Warbirds, as Andrea mentioned, at Mesa Falcon Field, the program run by the Arizona Commemorative Air Force Museum. Okay, so pilot Pete Joel is joining us this morning to tell us all about this and how you can get involved. Good morning, Pete. Good morning. Well, what an exciting day, not only for you guys, but for all of us here in Arizona. I mean, is this truly open to anyone that wants to come and take part? It certainly is, yes. We like to open our museum to all the visitors who want to come out. And if you decide to come fly with us, we're going to make that available to you as well. So, so tell us about this, uh, this aircraft we're looking at. It really is a beauty. Thank you. Yes, this airplane is an N2S Stearman. It was a primary trainer for the U.S. Navy, teaching uh, World War II pilots to uh, do their first initial flight training before they went out to go fly off of carriers uh, in the, like I said, the U.S. Navy during, during the war. All right, so uh, is, this is the uh, plane that we would fly in if we sign up to, to take part in this. Is that correct? Yes, we have a variety of aircraft. This morning, the, uh, the N2S is going to go flying along with our T6, which is a slightly larger trainer as well. Um, but this is what's going to be flying this morning. It, as you can see, it's an open cockpit biplane, and it's a beautiful morning to come flying out here over the, uh, the beautiful Arizona landscape. Isn't it so true? It's gorgeous out there at Falcon Field in, uh, in the East Valley. Give us an idea. How many, uh, how many aircraft are, will you guys have available for the public over the, this event here? We have uh, seven aircraft. Two of them are currently out uh, touring the, uh, the rest of the country, so our two bomber aircraft. But normally we fly between three and five aircraft every weekend. You can sign up for those online, or we also have people manning our phone lines to, uh, to sign up for those um, ride opportunities, we call them. Okay, can you give us an idea of how much it would cost if we decide to go ahead with this? Sure, the, the Stearman here costs $175. It's about a half an hour ride experience. Uh, it kind of goes up from there. We do have a website, and most of our prices are posted currently on the uh, azcaf.org website, and you can just check on there for ride availabilities and prices as well. So riding in this aircraft, um, it's open air, so are, are you wearing a helmet when you're getting in that thing? Yeah, just like back in the day, we wear a cloth yes. flying helmet. Uh, <laughs> we can probably bring a scarf if you really want one, but um, we do wear the, the cloth flying helmet. It's wonderful. You're just flying out in the open blue. It's kind of like the world's biggest motorcycle ride. That is so perfect. Yeah, beautiful. Well, thank you so much for sharing this <laughs> with us. Hopefully, lots of people have listened and are eager to uh, jump on board with you. Thank you so much, Pete. Well, thank you for having us. Have a good day. It is so cool out there. Yeah. You can see the big plane kind of out on the side of the, uh, the airport.